Hey guys, today we're checking out There's Something About Mary from 1998. Let's get to it. I know it's Ben Stiller and Cameron Diaz in a 90s comedy, so I'm excited! If you missed Dodgeball with Ben Stiller and Vince Vaughn and a whole bunch of other cool people, make sure you check that one out. I loved it! Is this the movie adorable? Matt Dillon, that sounds familiar. Ew, that's a creepy bug. Even it, what is this, claymation? I freaking love claymation. There's something about Mary. I think this is kind of a romancy rom com, which is good because V Day is coming up soon. This is so cute. Oh, that's a cool transition. When I was 16 years old, I fell in love. Cute. Hey, your niece. Hey. So I was wondering, I don't, I don't know. She's not uh, into it. If, if maybe you wanted to. Look at Ben Stiller. I was looking at the girl, but look at him. I, I just wonder if maybe you're going to the prom. Maybe you want to go with me. She does not want to go with you. Like, look, I, I heard this rumor that this guy like was going to ask me. So I, I'm going to wait and see what happens there. That sounds great. Yeah. Was that a yes? Well, no, it was a no, but what? So is that like a, is that like a yes or a no? I'm with you, Ben. I thought I made it perfectly clear. If everything else falls apart, maybe. Not cool, man. That's not an answer. Ooh, there she is! Oh my god, she's so pretty. Her name was Mary. The babest of all the babes. I heard she's going with some guy named Woogie. Who? Big guy. Goes to Barrington High. Sounds like a loser. Loser? Look at his pimple. Have, have, have you seen my bed box? Hey, check it out. Don't you dare tease have him. Have you seen my bed box? Hey, buddy. Are they gonna tease him? No. You see that girl over there? She has it. Except that she doesn't call it a baseball. They're just messing with them. Have you seen my wiener? <laughs> what? Oh no. What the hell did you just say, buddy? Huh? Wiener? Dude, dude, I don't want to see him get beat up. I was fucking son of a bitch. Good, I'm good. Ben Stiller, stop it. Yes. Come on, get up, fat boy. Come on, guys. What the fuck are you? Guys, huh? Yeah, man. No, no, wait, wait, stop it. Are you okay, man? You know him? He's my brother. Uh, I'm a brother. Jerk. Ben Stiller stuck up for him. Thanks, Ted. Ted. I'm still calling him Ben. I couldn't believe that she knew my name. name. Some of my best friends didn't know my name. I'm telling you, this year is the 49ers. 49ers. She's like every dude's dream. Piggyback ride. Huh? Piggyback. Uh -oh. Warren, stop. Ooh. Piggyback Ted. ride. Leave Ted alone. Oh, I thought he wanted to get on Ted's back. Oh, he's <laughs> a real time today, <laughs> wasn't he? Huh? My turn now. Oh, oh, uh oh. Uh, no, no. Well, I don't. It's okay, Ted. Oh. You have to. <laughs> That's fun, huh, Warren? Oh, she's so sweet. Thanks for walking us back. Yeah, no problem. I'm, I'm uh. Ask her the prom. So are you, are you, are you going to the prom? Huh? Thought maybe we, um, Dumb. we could go together. Like a date. Oh my god, so cute. You, you and me? Well, is that a yes or a no? Sure. His braces. I had braces for like four full years, so I feel the brace face. From that moment on, the guys at school looked at me in a whole new light. You're a f liar. <laughs> and she asked him. What happened to Woogie? She said he, she broke up with him, that he was getting weird on her. Oh, I hope they go together and like nothing happens. She's nice though. I don't think she'll back out. The music in this is already good. So 80s. <laughs> What the hell are you on? I'm Ted Stroman. I'm here to take Mary to the prom. Prom? Mary went to the prom 20 minutes ago with a boyfriend, Woogie. Oh, no. Charlie, you were so mean. <laughs> this is, is Mary's oh stepfather, my God. Charlie. I'm <laughs> Sheila, her mother. Oh, that's very funny. Oh, here she comes. Let's see. Oh, oh honey, you look God. beautiful. She does look beautiful. She's gorgeous. I'm having like a fear that he's just that like all of this is a daydream or something. Hope this is real. Hey, Warren, when did you say hi to Ted? About 10 times. <laughs> I think I found your baseball. Then I think I saw it right behind your ear. <laughs> oh, why? Oh, no, why? Why did you do that? <laughs> Oh, it's its ears? Hey, hey, Ted, I'm, I'm just gonna go upstairs real quick, okay? I just need two minutes. I, 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 I gotta fix I'll my dress. Yeah. Nah, just cut the other strap off. Make it strapless. I feel like everything's about to go horribly wrong, isn't it? suddenly appear. Best pee ever. Oh, no, I... Oh, no, I was... Oh, no, I... oh God, this is so bad. Oh, no. Oh, in the zipper! You know, he's been in there over a half an hour. 
Singy's master. No, no, like the opposite of that. It, it got it stuck. You got what stuck? It. No. Oh! In the zipper? Listen, uh, it's not the end of the world. These kind of things happen. Uh. Do they? Sheila, honey, uh, uh you gotta come no. here. You gotta, you, you gotta see this. What? Sheila, do not go in there. Uh, there really does seem to be an awful lot of skin <laughs> coming through there, so I, I'm gonna find some back tea, honey. Do they have to, like, go to a merge? Me? Really? Oh, oh my there. God, there's a cop oh, at the window. Oh, Christ. What <laughs> the hell's going on here? <laughs> Neighbors said they heard a lady scream. <laughs> You're looking at him. <laughs> well, I think that's appropriate. Oh my god. Lenny, Who? come here. Bro, take a look at what this numb nuts did. Numb nuts, definitely. Holy ah, shit! No, they showed it! <laughs> No, 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 no. Get down here no. quick. Bring everybody. Bring a camera. You're not going to believe this. What, what's your name? No. <laughs> no, that was so gross. I wasn't ready. <laughs> oh, God. We don't have to do anything because we're going to swear this over the... All right, look, I can go to the prom. We'll deal with it later. Oh, my God. They're going to have to unzip it. Now we're just going to back it up. Oh, Teddy. Frig. Oh, God, please don't show it. It's just like pulling off a band-aid. I don't want to see it. A one. And This is uh, worse two. than the exorcist. And, uh... We got a bleeder! Oh, keep the, keep the oh my God, he's bleeding. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh, Ted. None of this ever happened to Woogie. None of this would never happen to Woogie. Okay, let's roll. Wow. The worst prom ever. So anyway, uh... It's just in therapy mode. <laughs> yes. I worked all summer to pay off those debts and... Did his therapist sneak out for lunch? Oh my god. 13 years ago. No, that's very interesting. At least take your napkin off, man. I was driving down the highway last week. I started thinking about <laughs> Mary. All of a sudden it was like I couldn't breathe. I mean, I... I, I... <laughs> therapist. So I pulled off the road and I just sort of stopped in this, um, I guess it was a rest area. You know, rest areas are homosexual hangouts. What are you saying? Ooh. Time she's up. I can't believe you just left and went to eat lunch. Oh my God. I called you gay? Let me ask you a question. When you smoke a cigar, do you ever pretend it has balls? You know, like, I have. Haven't you? Is that a thing? Do people do that? I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna set you up with my new assistant at work. You're gonna love her. Let's face it, Dom. I'm in a slump. Lately, I've been feeling like, like a loser. Oh, that's the worst. In the eye. Hey, you guys. I uh, thought you might like some food with your beer. What sure. do you want? You want something else? Mm -hmm. No. Come on. You want something to eat? Mm -hmm. Not hungry. This is exactly like when I visit my parents. It's like, are you hungry? No. Let me make you something. No, that's fine. I'm going to bake something right now anyway. That's what I want. Uh, oh, family. And... Oh, I need him to fall in love with Mary. How about you, the big L? Ever been? What? In love? In love. Love. Mary. Oh, God. I'm Mary again. The one that got away, really. It was brief, but it was... It was... Definitely love, Dom. I mean, crushes don't last for 13 years, right? Well, my crushes last a long time. I told you she moved with her family to Miami. You know what you should do is like hire a private investigator, you know, to find her, follow her around. Not follow her around. Maybe find her. There's this guy down in my office. He's a claims investigator. He shoots down to Miami every couple of weeks or so. He can help you out. This guy runs a little hot, but he gets the job done. He runs hot, like, like temper-wise? So... Look at this mustache. Dom tells me you're looking for some lady friend you knew back at school. I'm the kind of guy who likes to shoot from the hip. Were his pants undone? <gasps> Is that normal? Do people sit down and undo their pants? Did you knock this skirt up? Is she's blackmailing you, right? You want her dead, don't you? He just has a crush on her. <laughs> you're not serious, are you? You know what? Forget it. Just forget the whole thing, all right? Okay, I'll do it. All right. Hey, come with me. What is this, like, accordion? So 90s. Ely, you dog! Sully, look at you! Look at that dog! Hey, good fella. Whoa, that's a big dog. I only have TD dogs, as you know. There you go. Look at that photo of the naked lady with the snake on her. Man, it looks like you really cleaned up your act. Hey, what do you say we go out and grab a couple of pops before you go to work? I don't drink anymore. What the? <gasps> no! That's Bill. Don't worry, I fed him last week. No. Does he bite? 
Nips. Uh, pff, no. It's you I'm worried about. You're worried about me? Yeah, you gotta learn to bend a little bit or believe me, you're gonna break. It. Just peer pressure him into it. Oh, I don't wanna fall off the wagon. Uh, not after 19 months. Exactly. 19 months. Uh, okay, mustache is a bad friend. Well, actually, they both have mustaches. Skinny stash is a bad friend. That's her. Husband, negative. Oh, that's such a good haircut for her. Children in a Oof. Labrador, negative. Tight little package, affirmative. I kind of wish my hair was that short. Good morning, Magda. I don't know if I could pull it off. Hi, doll, you're in my light. Sorry. <sighs> Look at this lady, she is toasted. Meaning these are the people you live amongst. You got a right to know if they're creeps. For instance, do you know the guy in the greenhouse? Cheating on his wife. That's not your old beeswax, Magda. Because Puffy used to bark his balls off whenever he saw him. And you know that Puffy, he only barks at the bad people. I honestly didn't even notice that dog on her lap. She's very distracting, but a dog. Look at his dog. This mommy. This mommy. It's not like a gentleman. He's a good boy. Oh, I want to pet him. I love dogs. Will you marry me, Mary? Oh, uh, I would love to, Jimmy, but um, I'm already uh, engaged to Freddie. Chris Freddie, isn't it? Yeah, it's you. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, man. You're welcome, Zach. No onions. No onions. No. She's so sweet. <laughs> when a guy can play 36 holes and still have enough energy to take me and Warren to a ball game and eat hot dogs. That's my ad. Print it up. Well, that's every dude. He has to be self-employed. Like a drug dealer? <laughs> <laughs> Thinking along the lines maybe of somebody like an architect or something. We can do it anywhere and just leave at a drop of the hat. Where would you and your beer bellied architect go into? Super Bowl? Yeah. He's like, yeah, that's, this all sounds great. What really happened with Brett? You know what Tucker said Brett told him? He said that if Warren wasn't in my life, that he would have popped a question a long time ago. <gasps> That's horrible. To hell with Brett. I've got a vibrator. <laughs> yeah, girl. So is that you? You think you're s drunk? Is it the dude and he's drunk? Uh-oh. Fine, I just wanted to call you and let you know I'll have your car back to you in a couple hours. She just takes care of everybody. Here comes the money shot. <laughs> Need bigger. Binoculars. <gasps> no. Oh, good. <laughs> gross. So far, all the like nudity and gross stuff has been so gross. I got some excellent news for you, my friend. Oh yeah, excellent. Let me ask you something. Was Mary a little big bone back in high school? Is he gonna lie to him? Four kids, three different guys, but no rock. Man, dude, this guy's the worst. Don't you want the name of the housing project? Uncool, man. Okay, this guy is the worst. I've declared it right now. Where are you going? Huh? Uh, I took a uh, job offer. <clears throat> I still want to look her up. Aww, he's so sweet. You know what? All the same, I think I want to call her. I, just, I just feel bad, you know? The poor thing, she's in a wheelchair. Oh my god, he's such a good dude. I, I guess I, I still have feelings for her. This girl really means something to you, huh? Is he going to tell him the truth, or is he just going to keep lying? I'll get your number just as soon as she gets back from Japan. Oh, uh, you've heard of mail-order brides, haven't you? Well, they go that way, too. Mary's a... What, what are they, desperate? She's a whale! Don't forget, it's a sumo culture. They pay by the pound. <laughs> sort of like, uh, sort of like tuna. Oh, no! This guy really doesn't want him to see her. Go to Miami yourself, Ted. I'm going to go get a soda. You want one? No, thanks. Uh, look, I'm sorry to bother you again, but uh, you got change of a dollar? No. That's not a good pickup line, man. All I got are these damn Nepalese coins. Oh. He's gonna use all the info we got. So what's your name? Pat Healy. Wanna know mine? I already know it, Mary. Because it's right there in your golf bag. Oh man, he's playing her. Wow, are, are those blueprints? Are those plans like he's an architect? Shut up. My real passion is my hobby. I work with retail. <laughs> no one's gonna tell me who I can and can't work with, right? Well, this is her dream guy. Those goofy bastards are just about the best thing I've got going in this crazy world. Oh my God, she's falling for it. Hey, Bob, remember Mary? Hey, you know, I saw her a couple months ago at a convention in Las Vegas. <gasps> oh, yeah, yeah. Tell him. She looked the same. You know, I'm a chiropractor. She's an orthopedic surgeon. She's a what? She's still a fox. 
He's gonna know that guy's lying now. Who's the lucky guy? Look at his dog. His name's Pat. Met him at the driving range. It's like that movie, Harold and Maude. I never saw that. Should I see it? It's about two people connecting, having something in common. My little puppy here <laughs> is going to tell you oh, everything you need to know about that guy in about two seconds flat. I do think dogs have are a good judge of character in general. <gasps> was he going to put him to sleep? Dude, you don't know how, how, anything about this dog. Oh, puppy. That is amazing. He doesn't like anybody. He, he never usually likes guys. Oh, he's so sweet. Would you like a cup of tea or something? Oh my, Magda. Buffer. Is he okay? Buffer. <gasps> oh no, no, no. <gasps> oh my god. What? Okay, I'm glad this isn't like a real dog. This is obviously a fake dog. <gasps> He's gonna like you. <gasps> He's on fire! Okay, well, this is wacky. It's not like a John Wick situation. <sighs> this is horrifying. <gasps> oh my god. Buddy. He's got him wrapped up like a baby. <laughs> <laughs> like E.T. My friend Tucker is upstairs and I want you to meet him. He's an architect too. Is he gonna be able to tell that he's a fake? Hey, Tucker! <laughs> Does she have like an, like an instinct like this guy's a doofus? This is my friend Pat Healy. Pat is an architect as well. Oh, really? Oh, where are your offices? Uh, mainly I work out of Boston. Is he gonna be able to lie about it? You build the Estadio Olimpico? No, just down the street, the Salinto Cateyente. It's quite a fine example. Is he onto him? He's giving him like the look like, uh-huh. Hey, thanks for picking me up, man. You know they made it illegal to hitchhike in this state? Uh, I'm a salesman. <laughs> I'm gonna start my own company. You want in? I, nah. No, no, thank you. <laughs> you heard of this thing, the eight minute app? Or listen to this, seven minute Am. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah, you know what? I gotta pee. I'm just gonna pull over. We leave that guy for a bit. Wow! Oh, hey, wait your turn. Hey, I didn't get it. Get it. Oh, what are we Whoa. doing here? <gasps> oh, God. Is he about to get No, 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 no. I was peeing. Yeah, I'm sure you're all just pissing. Let's go. Let's move it out. He's getting arrested. What does he have? That's not like a body, is it? You know, that grandmother of yours is really something. Who, <laughs> Magda? No, Magda's not my grandmother. She uh, rents the apartment next door. Oh, I thought they were roommates. Are you a movie buff? Well, I try to be, but it's tough going out there. I hate them. I guess I just wish they made movies like they used to make. You know, classics like The Karate Kid or Harold and Maude. She's gonna fall in love with this doofus. Hey, guys. Don't kiss him. This is the one time in a movie I'm saying don't kiss him. I'll see you around. Okay. Well, uh, Mary. Yeah? He's gonna say something else to swindle her. Can I uh, feel your bosoms before I go? Knock yourself out. She's gonna let him. No, no, no. Okie doke. So, tomorrow night? <laughs> well, that sucks that that doofus got to feel her up a little bit. Where'd they find the body? In a big red bag. It was a body. Look, I didn't solicit any sex, okay? I mean, this is a huge misunderstanding. It's okay, we believe you. Well, we found a body in your car. Problem is, we found your friend in the car. To get caught for everything, you admit it. Dude, no, don't say anything. Yeah, guilty as charged. You know, the guy even told me, the hitchhiker told me it was illegal. <laughs> He's acting so cool of like nonchalant because he doesn't know they're talking about murder. I love it. This wasn't your first time. No. <laughs> he will. Hey, you know, I know this is the Bible Belt and everything, but where I come from, this is not that big a deal. You're gonna fry. <laughs> hey. Oh my god. Uh, poor Ted. Nothing goes right for him. I wanted to talk to you about your friend Patrick. Is he gonna say like he's not an architect? Yeah, 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 yeah. He gave me this funny vibe. And he's not listed as a Harvard alumnus. Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Just be careful. Jigs up, pal. I would like to apologize to you 
for any pain or... Look at him in bed with his friggin' snuggle buddy. This morning, a man was apprehended not far from where you arrested. Subsequently, he confessed to the murder you're being held for. Thank God. Get to Miami, man. You are a lucky son of a bitch. That hitcher you picked up was about to cut your throat before you decided to take a piss. Holy! That's dark! No, Ted, the, the bad news I got is about our friend Healy. Landlady said when he came back from Miami, he kept talking about falling for some doctor <laughs> named Mary. Hi, Mary? Well, honey, he's a psycho. Mary, the guy's full of shit. So she's figured it out. Okay. Uh, I got a date tonight with that Mary girl I told you about. My God, we hit the mother load. You guys, should we be listening to this? Yes! She's a great gal, Mary. I'm the dumb shit for lying to her. Is he at this? He's lying again? You tell her about the irrigation ditches you dug in Sudan. The hope you gave Freddie the leper in Calcutta. <sighs> They're all swooning. We're dicks. No! Your guts are right. Listen to your guts, ladies. Come here, baby. Come here, sweetheart. <gasps> Can a dog and a soon. snake really live on, together man. like that? Who would win in a fight between that giant dog and that big snake? Um, look, there's something I have to tell you. I'm not the architect. Oh. Gross. Can't she see? I mean, I guess not. She is very trusting. Okay. Now they're just spying on her. Jeez. Hey, leave him alone. He's just got a big appetite. Isn't that right, Warren? Huh? I said, you got a big no! appetite. <laughs> Don't touch his ears. Listen, you can't touch his ears unless he trusts you. I'm sorry. Are you okay? I'm happy he got punched in the throat. What? I don't know what to say. What are you talking about? Just tell her the truth about Healy. Yeah, say you hired him. Mary! No, Mary! Mary? Is that... <laughs> That's it, it is. Good. How She's are you? Okay, good. Good to see you. Good to see you too. Handshake. How are you? Um, how are you? I'm... <laughs> I can't believe. That's I can't so believe that he remembers you. He likes Ted. What are you doing tonight? Do you think maybe you want to maybe, I don't know, go out to dinner, you know, catch up on old times? Can we just do that? Okay. I'm f***ing with you, Ted. <laughs> oh, okay, good. <laughs> Could you give it eight? Sure. Okay. Okay. Cool. I am a little psyched. I ran into this guy I haven't seen since high school. Did she still like him? He was so cute. He was so shy and clumsy, and he had this huge mouthful of metal. She's so cute. Oh, God, that reminds me. I have to call and cancel with what's-his-face. Wait a minute. Do, do, I, do I sense a chill in the air? She doesn't like kissing him, because you're a creep, creepster. <laughs> I brought you a little thirst quencher, oh. Mag. <laughs> Just want to get you drunk so you'll pass out, and I can give Mary a good rogering. <laughs> <laughs> Rogering. Oh, someone told me in one of my James Bond movies that Rogering. Mary, the man's a killer. I have a friend in the Boston Police oh, Department. Oh, it's he true. He's like, ah, oh, fucking crap. Now, oh, well, just calm down. Everything's going to be fine. Don't worry. He knows where she lives. Famine, famine. It's not gonna hurt this guy, is he? Now I'm thinking he's waiting outside. He's just gonna murder this guy. And I don't know, Dom. I don't feel good. I feel nervous. I really feel nervous. Well, let's hope he doesn't zipper his crap into his zipper again. You choke the chicken before any big date, don't you? Is that a thing? <laughs> of course that's why you're nervous. Oh, my dear friend, please sit. <laughs> Let me teach you the ways of being a man. Holy shit. I've been going out with a loaded gun. <sighs> he looks awful. What? Is he lying too? He doesn't need those things. Oh, Smashing the seal. You know, I'm gonna kick your Tell ass. Us what's going I love on. her, man. Doesn't even have an accent. I love Mary, man. I'm a phony. Just like you. The only thing I knew was that you were a fake. So was all the murder stuff real? My real name's Norm. Norm. I'm a pizza delivery boy. Holy Mary has a problem with men. <laughs> To some wacky wacky music. Better hurry. She's not gonna walk in, right? Well, I guess now we can relax. Where the hell did it go? <laughs> you can't find it. Hey, hey. no. Hey. Yeah. You're looking very beautiful. She does look beautiful. What is that? Hmm? Oh no. On your ear. Ear? Is that a hair gel? Say yes. Great. Yeah, I can use No, 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 don't, don't, you don't have to. You don't. You don't. <laughs> I just ran out. So, so when you say, um, 
killer. You mean? I think he's a murderer. <laughs> hey, Ken, I've got a couple of brews over here, man. Hey, Tracy, how are the twins? Man, he's so different without his accent. How the hell did you meet Mary? Yeah, I want to know. I delivered a pie to her one night, and she answered the door in her nightgown and <laughs> laid out in her office with a broken back. Broken back? A friend. A baseball bat. He really broke his back to meet her? That's psychotic. So you're a writer? Yeah, well, I'm trying to be. How about you? How did you manage to stay single all these years? Are they smoking a joint? Well, I'm bisexual, so that's hard for a lot of guys to understand. I mean, everybody has Ted. a bit of... I'm yeah. <laughs> She's always messing with him. Come on, let's go. The dog has little cucumbers on his eyes. Wait, how many is this? It seems like an awful lot of speed to get one little poop. Speed? Oh, so they're both gonna be on speed? Hey, you wanna go upstairs and watch Sports Center? <laughs> Magda! <laughs> Dude! Get that down! Thanks, Dolly. Oh my god. The dog. Where's right your dog? Where is Puffy? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He was being a pest, so I put him in the bath. Can you do me a favor? Would you mind letting the dog out of the bath? Oh no. It's like throwing himself against the door. Are you the little guy making all that big noise? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> They're really getting their use out of this fake dog. Let me stop it! <laughs> Take a little bit of the neck. Oh my god. <laughs> Don't you dare. <laughs> Dude! <laughs> ben Stiller fighting a dog. Oh, his poor nuts in this movie. <laughs> Oh my god. Well, once again, that couldn't have gone any worse. Oh my god. Oh my god, full body cast. Oh my god. Poor puppy. I still feel like he's lying to her though. He should tell her the truth. He has to. Flowers are for you. Ball is for Warren. Did you hire Pat Healy to spy on me? Oh no. I got an anonymous letter. Poor Mary. What were you trying to do? Trick me into feeling something for you? She always gets tricked. I feel so bad for her. Just leave. Okay? And he's a nice guy. Ted should understand this. I did it because I never stopped thinking about you. And if I didn't find you, I knew that my life would never ever be good again. This is sad. I'd be like so confused if I was her. Neely! You in there? Clunk him on the head. Oh, it's a pretty nice place. Fuck up. Oh, oh. oh Penny, gosh. surprise! Oh. Who the f is this guy? Another guy that's trying to swindle Mary. Did he eat the dog? You're gonna tell me you didn't write her an anonymous letter telling her about our whole deal together? What letter? Well, maybe that dude did it. It was you. He's been in the game longer than either of these guys. You probably did it yourself. Yeah, I don't know who to believe. They're all lying. Because if it wasn't for me, she might have married that schmuck. This guy's the worst. You know, if it if it wasn't you sent the letter and I, I never sent it, who sent it? Oh, hey, how? If the dog is there, then who's... Is it the dude and the snake, the guy? Oh, Sully. The man? Hmm. That reminds me of a really scary snake story I have. Okay, so the snake ate the dude. All right. <sighs> Wookie? the hell is Woogie? Uh, Did you get my letter, Mayor? Y you sent that? <laughs> He's the craziest one of them all. I mean, something. You were absolutely right. <laughs> I needed help. <laughs> That's great, Woogie. Call 911. Except for the, the, the rash thing's still there, right? These are called love blisters. They went away for a little while. Ew. But then you came back in my life, milady. I did not come back into your life. Let's not forget here, you put me through a lot of bullshit, okay? He's a psycho, too. Give me, give me a break here, okay? I was a little, a little nuts, a little... Yeah! I'm asking you to leave. Oh, Mary. 
Oh, Mary, you got this all wrong. Ben still has to come in and save her. Until I get something to remember you by. What does that mean? <laughs> well, this is the one time that the stocking will save her life. This one pair you get owe it. me that, you <laughs> heartless! It's not gonna hurt her, he just wants her shoes. Tucker, what happened to your crutches? Oh, yeah. Name's Norm. I live with my folks up in Pompano. Hey. Poor Mary! Dom, what are you doing here? You stole her from me, and now I want her back. Ew, that I think. You're Woogie? Dom Wooganowski. All right, what the hell is going on? <laughs> Magda. She's living the life. We're all in love with Mary. I say none of us leaves this room until our young Mary here stops jerking us around and decides once and for all who she really wants. None. She wants none. Hi, Mary. <laughs> Brett? What the hell is Brett Favre doing here? Even I know that's a football dude. See, your friend Tucker was lying about a couple of other things. That's the right thing to do. He loves Warren. He loves you too. That's the right thing to do, Ted. None of them love you. They're just fixated on you. That's that's mm -hmm. not real love. Mary, don't listen to him. Tell me that you're not nuts about this girl. Yeah, that's what I'm telling you. He did the right thing. I'm very proud. I'll uh I'll see you, Mary. Hey, Ted. Hey, Warren. See you later. Okay, goodbye, Ted. He let him touch his ears. <laughs> oh yeah, I mean he still loves her, I think. Is this gonna be the end of this movie? He's just bawling. Well, she's back with her old boyfriend. Is this the end? Aw, <laughs> poor Ted. Let her go, let her go, let her go. I don't know how this is gonna end. Oh my god, just <laughs> weeping. Mary? Ted! You've got your keys. <sighs> oh! Did you really mean what you said up there? I just want you to be happy, Mary. But I'd be happiest with you. Yes, I believe you would. You're with me, right? <sighs> That's fair. What about... Brett Favre? <laughs> What did I tell you the first time we met? I'm a Niners fan. This is the big one, Ted. Give her a kiss. Yeah! His friends would say, stop whining. They've had enough of that. Nice. No, 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 what are you doing? That's my girl he's kissing. Oh my god. Okay guys, well that was There's Something About Mary. And that was a good one. It was unexpected though. I, I wasn't expecting like the dark stalkery side of it. And that really kind of surprised me. Uh, but it was super funny. Ben Stiller was charming as always. Cameron Diaz was like amazing. The dog was cute. Good music all the way through. I really liked this one. I thought it was super fun and really kind of weird and quirky. Very 90s. Yeah, I definitely liked it. If there are more Ben Stiller movies I should check out, more Cameron Diaz movies I should check out more comedies from the 90s make sure you let me know below i did like ben and cameron and the 90s comedy i loved all of that so make sure you let me know some good suggestions down below mvp we're gonna give to cameron diaz because i just feel so bad for her she was like stalked by all these men and like kept being lied to and i just feel really bad for her in this movie and of course it was like silly and lighthearted, but that, that's a not a cool thing like to have a bunch of stalkers after you all the time just because you're so beautiful and, and wonderful so poor Cameron Diaz in this movie luckily at the end she got to be with Ben Stiller so that was good Cameron Diaz she was absolutely electric she was beautiful she was lovely and charming and I loved her in this so I'm gonna give Cameron Diaz Mary the MVP Okay, MVP, we will give it to Ben Stiller as Ted. I was definitely rooting for him, and even in the end, I wasn't sure they were gonna end up together, but he did the right thing, and I was proud of Ted. Doing the right thing works. It's good karma. So, Ted, you're the low-key MVP. And the worst award is tricky because there were a lot of doofuses in this movie. All the dudes that were lying to her and trying to, like, trick her and stalk her are obviously the worst. The hitchhiker that was a serial killer was also the worst. So, what I'm gonna do is give the worst award to the grossest thing in this movie, which was the zippering of the nuts. Uh, that was so gross and, like, shocking that they showed it. I really didn't think they were gonna show it. So, I felt that pain 
pain, even though I'm not a dude, I feel like that's some visceral, visceral stuff. So zippering your nuts, I'm sure, is the worst. Overall, this one was awesome. And definitely let me know if you guys want to see some more comedies. And thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I had a great time. I hope you had a great time too. And I will see you next time. Bye guys.